uh, hello, can you hear me? Yes. Yeah, okay. Uh, today, I'm very glad that we have the first meeting of Modern Zoo Group. Uh, several colleagues who attended the meeting are co-members of our group. Uh, before we speak, we will introduce ourselves, uh, mainly our, our names. Uh, today's topic is to discuss the catalog and the readme tem template of Model Zoom. I wrote a first draft according to the ideas of all of you in the early stage. Uh, we can uh, use use it. Uh, so, Lian, can you help share the screen for us? Yeah, sure. No problem. Yeah, okay. Uh, we can discuss it now. Yeah, who, who please? Uh, Lian, can you uh, can you tell your ideas about the uh, template of uh, readme? Uh, sure. So, so this is a template of the uh, model zoo readme, which includes the models and implement implementations for uh, all the typical deep learning models in model zoo. So uh, you can see the table here, which includes the parameters, uh, including the uh, all the details about the uh, deep learning model. So let's say the Google Net here, and the resources, and all kinds of uh, the hardware configuration of the model sport, uh, manus ball, and the training parameters, and all the performance metrics here. And uh, the, mo uh, the models here, which includes the, uh, uh, in the field of the computer vision, so let's say uh, image classification, and uh, object detection and segmentation, let's say uh, YOLO V3 and uh, the other models in uh, natural language processing. So you can um, see all the uh, performance uh, just in this table. So this is readme. Yeah, and okay. Yeah, okay, uh, good. Uh, the other colleague, uh, Dr. Uh, Guo Qi, can you uh, share your opinion to us? Okay, first I think uh, not all of the parameters in the table are necessary for every uh, network. Uh, uh, for example, for the uh, uh, computer vision or the uh, 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 NLP, uh, uh, not all the parameters are necessary. I think we should do the different uh, template of the of each uh, network. Uh, and second, I think uh, some of the uh, uh, description in the table should be consistent. Uh, the resource should be ascent. Ascent 910 is not Huawei 910. So uh, please fix them. Uh, and the losses, I think the losses, uh, some network has, uh, some network have uh, multi losses and the loss is not, uh, it's a little bit confused for uh, every network. It should be treated different in uh, different network, I think. So that's my opinions. Yeah, okay, uh, good. Uh, so Lian, can you help to record uh, the suggestions and the opinions from our colleagues? Yeah, 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 sure. Yeah, okay. Uh, the other guy, uh, Hao Zhe, can you share your opinions with us? Mm, I just have a question. Mm, when here comes more hardware, where should we append other performance of uh, model zones in this table? Yeah, okay. Uh, the, do you have an, uh, another? Opinions about this template? Mm, no others. Thanks. Yeah, okay. Uh, the other guys, uh, Chen Hui, I here. Yeah, I'm here. I have no opinions. Yeah, okay. 
uh, so uh, Lian, can you uh, can you help to uh, share the the opinions uh, for us? Uh, so just uh, you mean collect all the op uh, opinions from all the colleagues, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, sure. So, yeah. Yeah, so uh, next we, uh, we should uh, discuss the catalog of modern zoo. The other fair. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh, Lian, can you share the uh, suggestions for, for us uh, about this catalog? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, sure. So this is the uh, we call the source code um, a directory of the um, uh, the models in uh, Model Zoo. So uh, we have this directory. The first is uh, utility, uh, which uh, helps us to uh, call the functions in the uh, utility to generate um, the. Uh, the, the, the functions that we need. And uh, the second is the uh, readme file, which we uh, have um, discussed uh, before. So this file readme. And uh, the, the third one is the uh, the model that uh, for the developers, they uh, will generate. So let's say here we have the Google Net model. And inside Google Net directory, we have the uh, another readme, which is a description of the uh, Google Net model and uh, another directory is scripts uh, which includes all the shells so let's say the first one is the uh, run underscore train which helps the uh, users to train the model and uh, the second is run uh, evaluation so uh, just do some evaluation on the unseen data set and the third one is uh, the pre-processing steps in the uh, shell so uh, which can help the users to process the uh, data set directory. And uh, another uh, directory is the source, uh, which includes two files. The first is dataset.py, uh, uh, which helps to pre-process the data sets from the uh, website. And the uh, second one is the uh, model, which includes the model architecture. Uh, from scratch. Uh, another directory we call IE uh, inside, uh, we, we call that is the um, uh, config. So that's a configuration of the, all the parameters uh, relating to the uh, training. So let's say uh, it should be some learning uh, rate or batch size. So all kinds of uh, configuration here. And the second one is a callback, which includes, let's say, the loss or uh, some 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 other uh, useful informations for the users. And the third one is the loss.py. So you can define your own uh, loss function here. And the other one is, uh, let's say, we have the uh, train.py, evaluation.py. That's for uh, training and. Uh, uh, inference. And the third one is uh, export. So you can export, after training, you can export your models. Um, so let's say in, in the format uh, to support uh, ONX, uh, so something like that. And uh, the next one is um, process data. And the, uh, the other one is the requirements txt which uh, includes all the third party packages inside the requirements and we also support the pre-training or the fine-tune model so let's say you have trained uh, we, we have already trained some models with uh, good parameters then you can pre-train your model using the uh, pre-trained models and you can also fine-tune uh, your scripts. So this is all the uh, directory in the uh, model zoo. So anybody has uh, any op opinions here? Uh, will we have an English version of the document? 
uh, now the comments are all in Chinese. Uh, yes, we, we will have the uh, English version of the, um, the directory, uh, the template here. Okay, thank you. Okay, I have several questions. Uh, the first, uh, yeah, the same question uh, as uh, as the colleague before. Uh, please switch the comments to English. Also, uh, the uh, readme files, please switch them to English. Um, second, uh, we should, I think we should make the clear definition of the directories. Uh, first, under the source, directory, I think there should be some uh, static files, which means it's, uh, they are only the definition of the, they are only the definition of the network. Uh, uh, in other words, they are not runnable. Okay, uh, in the outer, in outer directory, I think they are, they are runnable files, is that right? Which contains the main function, the train and available py they are vulnerable so uh, please make the definition more clear uh, uh, third I think we should make a more clear definition of the readme file the outer readme file um, I think uh, it's a summary of the networks uh, under the modern directory it's a summary right so uh, in the, the, the inner with me, I think there should be uh, something like the tutorial of uh, how to run the scripts under this uh, uh, under this uh, network uh, directory. Mm, so please make the definition more clear, so the so the developer will not be con confused. Yeah, thank you. Very good suggestions. So do we have any other suggestions on the um, directory of the model zoo here? Mm, according to different copyrights of different data set, maybe we should not provide the auto download script uh, for users to download the script from the, um, the orange data set website. Maybe we just introduce the, uh, the data set we used and uh, told the told our users how to download them and uh, um, instead of um, provide the auto downloading script thanks and uh, um, if you, if the script in youtube's directories only runs offline and uh, do not include any runtime dependencies. Maybe we should name it as tools instead of utils. Okay, so if we run uh, offline, uh, just rename it to tools, right? Yeah, this is about the utils directories, not the model directory. Okay, thank you. Also, I think we should make uh, make the direction of net each networks are uh, independent. Uh, they will not depend each other, uh, as well the utils or common or tools file. I think they should not depend on each other. All the networks should be independent. It only depends on the minus four package. Okay, thank you. Um, I suggest we need some suggestion from um, Liang Chenghui. Maybe some networks need the uh, um, custom operations. Maybe um, some of in some operations we don't provide in our framework, where should we place the um, script and uh, the source code in our modern zones? 
So you mean the uh, operations we do not support? Yeah, maybe some users could uh, um, build maybe their some custom, custom, custom operators, custom. which you, where we should place the custom operations. Okay. Maybe I think one suggestion. Um, I think we should we can make a uh, uh, another directory under the model room and name the uh, custom operations and place the uh, uh, source code, the DSL code, um, under this directory. I think that custom operations are uh, something like. Uh, um, something like a uh, common code uh, which uh, every network can be can use can use them um, it's just one suggestion i think that is good maybe we just um, place the the code in the source directory for the operators which is not widely used and uh, only built for this specific that work. Okay. Okay. I think. So do, do you have any more suggestions? Uh, I think the scripts are not uh, mm, are not mandatory mandatory uh, files. Mm, not mandatory, I think. Um, because this is just uh, the uh, shortcut uh, for uh, for users to run our scripts. Uh, I think the train dot py, the train dot uh, the and the evaluate and the evaluate dot py, that, that should be the main entrance uh, of the scripts. Uh, the share scripts, the share scripts are just. Uh, uh, shortcuts for for running this uh, to make make to make um, make this uh, network run. Yeah. Yeah. So um, actually, we want. This to is not necessary. I think it is not uh, um, how to say <laughs> uh, compulsory. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> mandatory. Yeah. Mandatory. Yeah. It's not mandatory. Yeah, because uh, the 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 idea is like we want to provide two versions for the users for different developers who, so let's say for developers who uh, used to run the uh, use the share scripts, then they can use this one, and we also support um, let's say the distributed um, uh, training in uh, run underscore train dot uh, yes. share file. Yeah. Yeah. So the other guys have any uh, another uh, opinions or suggestions for this template? Yeah, uh, can you hear me? Yes. Yeah, okay. So, uh, that guys. Mm, so what about the pre-trained checkpoint? The pre-trained model, should we pre provide our pre-trained model in these directories? Or 
maybe we should provide the, uh, the, the pre-trained model on our um, main website and uh, um, provide a hyperlink in our readme. Uh, yes. I think we should not put the uh, binary files uh, that the pre-chain model in this uh, code repos repository. I think we should make, make another repository or a uh, file server to store the uh, binary files. Okay, I agree with that. So, okay, uh, the other guys, uh, I have another opinion. Yeah, okay, uh, I think uh, today's meeting is very efficient. So after, after the meeting, uh, Lian, can you help to uh, summarize our suggestions and opinions? And uh, later we will share, uh, share with the whole uh, MySpool project team after modification. No problem. Yeah, okay. Uh, Okay, uh, today's meeting is very good. So we, we will finish uh, today's uh, discussion.